Yeah, I think that guy's stuck. All right, let's see if we can bust this out and get to you. <laughs> He's looking up at us. Let's go. Uh, get me unstuck so I can eat your brains. There, you're unstuck, pal. Welcome back, everybody, to Seven Days to Die. I'm an old guy gaming, and we play this game on insane difficulty. The zombies are all set to nightmare speed, and we're still on Alpha 19.1. However, 19.2 is inexperimental, and it's supposed to be coming out pretty soon, from what I understand. I still haven't read all the patch notes for that either, so I'll have to get around to doing that sometime. Okay, so in this episode, uh, it is the next morning. I did stuff <laughs> for the rest of Horde Night uh, after we killed the Horde. Um... Can't remember exactly what I did. It's been been a couple days since I played last, but uh, we got some stuff in here, anyways, in the forge, uh, cooking up, and the trader is now open. So we're gonna go check uh, the trader's inventory and sell this stuff because I don't remember when uh, they reset. And we want to repair this and this for sure, because and this for sure, because that's gonna give us and this for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Probably better repair everything. We're going to need to make some more repair kits, though. Um, uh, we want to repair that and that. The rest of this stuff, I mean, I guess it's worth repairing. What do we have for duct tape? Oh, we got lots of duct tape. And we have some glue, too. Okay, so that being the case, we might as well make some more repair kits. And uh, we'll repair these. Uh, once we get those repair kits made. Okay, so we'll put that iron back in there. Um, let's go head on over uh, to the trader. We'll make these sales and we'll just check and see when uh, their inventory resets. Because again, I like I said, I don't remember uh, when that's going to be. And then we've got two quests, both at the same location, uh, that we need to do. So that's the plan for today. And then probably after this episode, I will... Um, might as well just buy damn near all of this stuff. There we go. Um, I'm probably going to do another, uh, you know, like casual construction you. episode or two um, after this one. We'll see how things go. Uh, the, the other thing I want to also mention to you guys is, I don't think I've told you this yet. On October the 19th, I am going to be leaving on a business trip, uh, basically the first one that I've been on since last February, you know, when the whole COVID stuff started uh, shortly after. <clears throat> um, I'm going to Las Vegas. I live in Colorado, so I'm going to drive. I'm not going to fly, thank God, because I just don't like the idea of getting on a plane right now uh, with the way things are. Uh, so I'm going to drive, but I'm going to be gone for about a week or, or so. In fact, I'm going to be gone for... Eight days, about nine, probably nine days in total uh, if you count the driving time. So uh, during that time, I, of course, will not be making videos. I'm going to try and pre-record as many as I can, but probably won't have enough content uh, to keep them coming out uh, all the way until I get back. But we'll see how things go. Um, there, I should be able to pre-record enough to where, you know, you're not going an entire week without your old guy fix, but... <laughs> <laughs> it might there might be a few days uh, in between there where I don't have anything for you, but we'll see how things go. Maybe I will be able to get that done. It just just depends upon how how things go. Okay, anyway, enough of that. Let's go ahead and talk to Trader Hugh. Take a look at your inventory. So you restock on day twenty five. It's day twenty two. That means you do have a new inventory, don't you? Uh, okay, here, hold on a second. Didn't have money the moment I laid Oh, shut up. Let's um. Let's repair these other things so we can sell them for full price. Uh, I think that was it, right? Yeah, I think so. Okay, so let's take the sugar butts. And I just want to confirm now, I've got... I already have nerdy glasses on, right? Uh, nope. What am I doing? I'm going here. I do, okay. I just don't want to sell the only pair I have. Okay, so we're going to sell you this and this. Okay, I think that's everything we wanted to, to sell to him. So that gets us up to 73.78. Um, all right, now let's see what he's got for sale. 
get an elixir. We'll be getting one of those at some point to, uh, you know, to do a respec, but we're, we're not quite ready to do that yet for both because I don't have the money for it yet. And also because I need to get, you know, some more points built up before it makes sense for us to do a respec. Here's a yellow shotgun. The advantage this would have over our orange is two mod slots. It does 13 damage per pellet. So it does three more damage native per pellet too than our orange. And it would give us another mod slot. Do we want to blow 5,500 coin on that right now though? That is the question. Ooh, he's got a magnum too. Um, I'm not sure about that. I'm going to have to think about that. Maybe what we ought to do is go check the other traders too. Um, and see what they have before we, you know, make a decision, right? He's got an orange pump shotgun too. Okay. That's what I've sold him. If there's nothing else, you best be on your way. Do we have a job from you or... Yeah, we already have one from you. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go um let's go do those two quests and we'll check Trader uh Bob, Trader Bob's inventory. Um and see what he has. I guess I could have run over and check Trader Joel too. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Um I'll see you guys over there. Okay guys, we are at Trader Joel's. And Trader Joel has some company, some other shoppers. Yeah, 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 come here. So, uh, I did go all the way back to Trader... No, this is Trader Bob, sorry. I went all the way back to Trader Joel, and he had two things that I bought. Uh, he had Urban Combat, Sneaking Over Trash Makes No Sound, and I bought the Duckbill mod from him, because that's my favorite shotgun mod after the tube mod. Um, but I, d I decided not to show that on the camera because that's really all he had. So um, let's take a look and see what he's got in here. As usual, buy all food and mo most candies. Some candies I just don't find a, a lot of use for, like the drops, the drop hey, one, drops one, today? for example. Okay, what do you got, pal? Let's take a look at your inventory. Got a green pistol, some steel boots. Ooh. Oh, we already know that. Oh, that's right, we do. Okay, so we need just the chassis. What's this one? Figured out how to, oh yeah, that's mineral water. Yeah, we need that. We need it. Absolutely need that one. Okay, what do you got over here? Okay, so I think I want to go get that, uh, yeah, the yellow pump shotgun so that I can put the, um, the duckbill mod on it in addition to the tube mod, and it'll do just a little more damage for us. And we probably are going to do that before we do the quest um, 47. You know, I might be a little bit short, so... Oh, he's got a gyrocopter. Uh, so I might I have a bunch of weapons I can sell. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to do that, guys. I'm going to go back to um, a trader... Gain 5% more XP from kills at night. Yeah, we'll take that. Chainsaw schematic? Hmm. Fish tacos recipe. Oh, damn, that's expensive. Hunter's journal. 10% more damage wolf. Boy, that would come in handy, too. <laughs> There's so much stuff. Uh, you know what? I'm going to buy that. I'm going to buy that. I'm just going to do it. That's all there is to it. I'm going to buy that, too. Um, I, I've got more stuff back at the base that I can sell to get enough money to buy that yellow shotgun. Uh, I think that's all we want to do. Okay, so you kind, sir. I'm going to go back to the base, grab a, a couple of extra weapons and stuff that I can go resell to Trader Hugh so that I can buy uh, the yellow shotgun. We'll get that all fixed up, and then I will meet you back here at our quest location, which is a house that has killed me before. So I'm a, this house always puts me a little bit on edge, just, you know, bad memories <laughs> of that and we got to do it twice which means we're actually going to do it three times we're going to double loot it then we're going to do the first quest and then we'll do the second quest um but i would like to have that just a little bit better shotgun 
uh, before we do that. So I will meet you guys back over here and we will get started on those quests. All right, guys, we are at the house. So um, Fat Loot's are in the attic of this place. So we're just going to park our vehicle right out front here. And we're going to pull up to the roof. Um, so what I, I I was actually able to sell like a pile of stone and a bunch of parts. Um, yeah, to get enough money to, to buy this shotgun without having to sell any of my current weapons. So I was able to keep all of those because I'm probably going to eventually want them for parts. So if you look at my toolbar now, I actually have two shotguns. Um, I made another tube mod. Uh, so this one has the tube mod and the duck bill that I bought, and this one has the tube mod on it. So we have a total of um, 11 in the magazine there and 10 in the magazine here. So we have 21 shots that we can get off before we have to uh, reload. So I came loaded for bear. <laughs> I got two stacks of 762s, two stacks of nine millimeters, and three stacks, almost three stacks, of shotgun shells. So, um, if that if that doesn't uh, get us through this, then nothing will, right? Uh, all right, so let's uh, go ahead and hop up on the roof of this place, and uh, we'll double loot it before we start the the quests. I also took a quest from a uh, trader Joel for one of the shopping malls. Uh, that's back in uh, our our town, so we'll be working on that at some point too. Uh, let's maybe punch in right about here. Let's see what's what. Yeah, I think that guy's stuck. See if we can bust this out and get to you. <laughs> He's looking up at us. It's going, uh, get me unstuck so I can eat your brains. There, you're unstuck, pal. Okay. Good lord, how many Zekers are in here? No wonder this place killed me. Uh, wait, you're not dead yet? What the hell? Shoot him right in the balls. <laughs> Now he's dead. That's enough to kill anybody. Uh, all right, so <laughs> never a dull moment, right? Never a dull moment. Let's make sure we're loaded. We are. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. All right. Let's see what we got here. We got a couple chamois, a shotgun messiah, two shotgun messiahs. Well, uh, you know what? I've got eye candy back down at the bike. We might as well get it. I mean, kind of doesn't make much difference if we use it now or later. I suppose the one advantage to doing it later is then we can also loot other stuff in the house after we do the fat loots. in there yeah maybe we'll maybe we'll do it that way okay so let's uh, check the ammo got a barbed wire mod okay some blood bags there we go oh uh, you know what? I want that stamina mod actually these will probably end up scrapping for parts. Decent stuff, though, but not not the best in the world. Okay, we'll take that, too. Oh, man, I can make the big first aid kits now. Nice. I don't remember. Did we find a schematic for that? Can't remember. Um, we must have. So, cool. We'll have to start making those. All right, so we've got two different quests here. They're both stacked on top of each other there's a fetch and then there's a one of them's a fetch and clear here let's take a look at this oh no one's a fetch and one's a clear gotcha okay um so which one is tier three fetch how about if we well we got the clears the one that's the one that's marked 
What happens if we make that the active? They still both show fetch. All right, I guess it doesn't really matter, right? So, oh, we did get the clear. Uh, weird. I don't know if we'll be able to do the other one or not. Guess we'll have to wait and see. Oh, they're ready to come already. Take that guy's head off before he even hits the floor. That's the way to do it. That's the way to do it, man. Gonna have some Zikaroos in here, probably. We got Nurse Nancy in the hot tub. Oh man, she was feral too. No wonder it took so many whacks to take her down. Okay. So there's no Zikaroos in here, huh? Guess not. Alright, let's um Ammo. Very nice. Let's, um, get this brass here. You know what? I think I'm... Uh, we get electrical parts if we take them apart, but... It's faster just to do that, you know what I mean? Let's check this. Nice mineral water. We'll check this for acid. No, but we will take the coffee. Just do a quick check of the kitchen cupboards. That's pretty decent stuff there. I guess that's it. I'm going to scrap a doodle that and that since pipes are super easy to make, and we'll chuck those things. Anybody in here? Nice. Uh, we'll take the bones. At some point, I will probably make a garden. Um, but I don't think I want to take up inventory space with that stuff right at the moment. Anything up here? Nope. Okay, make sure everybody's loaded. I think we're going to get some resistance here in the garage. So we got two Zikaroos. Go down, Edgar. He's feral. Shoot you in the ass, Edgar. Okay. Let's check the El Coche. There we go. Always happy to have more repair kits and sewing kits. All decent stuff. Is there something down here? There surely is. Ammo pile. It's a beautiful thing. Oh, <laughs> look at that. I was thinking about buying that, too. I'm glad I didn't. And we also have uh, the Ratchet Schematic. At some point, I am planning on putting more points into salvage operations, but we're not... Uh, we'll wait for a bit before we do that. Um, so that we can make a good quality Ratchet when the time comes. Assuming we don't find the impact driver before then, which is a possibility. Okay, I think that's it for down here. Might as well look at this trash uh, scrap and take that. Okay. Let's head on up. <laughs> Got one Zikaroo here. Anybody in there? Doesn't look like it. What about in here? Might as well get him on the spikes, right? Well, no, actually, we want to kill him because we won't get XP if the spikes kill him. Got somebody else's attention somewhere uh, over this way. Oh, 
Where are you at, homie? There you are. Good lord. Can't shoot a damn thing. Okay, so we've got a bookcase in here. Nice and nice. Take both of those things. What I'll do is... I will, um... On our second time through here, we'll take the eye candy, we'll clear the place, and then loot afterwards. The second time through. Okay, so let's come around this way. More Joe? That is just so disgusting. Alright. Let's get ready for some more resistance. Nobody in here, huh? Okay, let's check the pictures for wall safes or other hidden goodies. All right, we'll take that. Probably won't ever use it, but we'll take it. There we go. Um, those of you who have watched me for a while know that I don't. I'm not really fond of the spear. It's actually a good weapon in the early game. But I've tried it in the late game, like fully decked out, and just wasn't all that impressed with it, really. This is a big, wide area here. I think we're clear in this immediate vicinity. Okay, let's scrap that. I'm going to drink that. I'm going to chuck those. Super easy to get. We might have to take a trip uh, back down to the bike here pretty soon. All right. Let's check the sink. Not taking empty jars. Guess we could scrap those. You know, I almost shouldn't be scrapping stuff either just because I mean I've got piles of iron back at the base for mining I don't think I'm gonna do it sorry if that hurt your feelings I know some of you some of you think I should loot every damn thing under the sun <laughs> just that's not my, the way I roll guys it's not the way I roll I'll loot stuff that I think that I need that's a priority at the time at the time that's that's how I roll uh, we will scrap that for paint I'm not gonna take that because here again Stacks and stacks and stacks at the house. Um, I'm going to just drink that right now. Okay, let's check these bookshelves. Okay, fittings mod, schematic. We already know that. We can get 110 bank for it, but I think in, for the sake of inventory, I'm just going to eat it and get a little bit of XP. Same thing here. And same thing here. We will take the paper. All right, let's get ready. Things are going to heat up here pretty soon. There we go. A little double barrel mod action. We already know that. And we know both of these. Landmines won't detonate when stepped on. Nice. I don't remember reading that, but I'm glad that we did. Okay, there's usually some nastiness in here. What I think I would like to do is run in really quick, shut that door, we'll deal with this guy. But we'll probably get more Zeeks coming through there too. Maybe we ought to light those bastards up. What do you think? It's 
want that door closed. Okay, we'll check the sinks. Not scrapping stuff. Definitely take 600 coin. Um, I already have two workbenches. I don't think we need another one. Besides, I've got more wrenches anyways back at the base. Ooh, toilet pistol. Hey, look at that. Our first toilet pistol of this series. It's a, always a welcome find. I'm going to throw away this flashlight. i got a ton of those. Um, let's get rid of this. Let's drink this. And you know what? I guess I'll pick the flashlight back up for the moment. We are going to have to go back uh, down and uh, offload here pretty quickly. Let's just move forward just a little bit more. We should probably also pop that. We'll counter it with a mineral water, which we can now make. It's fan fantastic. Best beverage in the game. Okay. I have been major rushed here before. That's why I'm trying to be a little careful. Anybody in here? Hello? Nothing in there. Okay, we'll take that. We're going to scrap this for the paper for shotgun shells because I'm actually really low on paper. One of these towns nearby has the paper mill, so we'll probably pay a visit uh, <clears throat> to that place to get more paper than we'll ever need for the whole rest of this playthrough. Okay. We might have a couple of, like, soldier baddies in here, so let's just... Oh, just a yell and a janitor. Okay, that's fine. And that'll take us up to the attic with the rest of the baddies. Let's check behind the pictures first. Got something there, a little purse action. With not a damn thing in it. We'll take that. Thought there was something down here to loot too, maybe not. Okay. Uh, all right, so let's see here. How do we want to play this? I think we're going to run... We're going to wake him up, run back through this door, and then get behind the door. Because um, there's a pretty fair number of Zeeks in here. There's five in total. I don't really have a good way to dispatch them quietly. I don't want to... Do we get all of their attentions? Sounds like they're over here, but they're probably just above us. Let's see if we can get some more to come down to the door here. Okay, we got her taken care of. Three more to go. You at the door? I can't tell. Hello? Oh, it's Hawaii 5 -0. Two more Zikaroos. Another Hawaii 5 -0. And one more Zikaroo. He's above us. Come on, dude. Come get some. Over here. All right, we're going to have to go up and get him. He's just a yo. Oops. Okay. Okay, so we have a return to Trader. <clears throat> I wonder, though, if... Do we still have that other quest in here? We do.
Okay. Well, yeah, let's let's go ahead and loot then, and then we'll do this. We'll run through this again. And um, uh, take the, the eye candy. What we'll do the second time is we'll just clear it. We won't loot anything. We'll just clear it, and then we'll take the eye candy, do the fat loots, and just kind of work in reverse uh, towards the end. So that's the plan, Stan. <coughs> Tell you what let's do, too. Uh, we don't care about the... <coughs> Excuse me, those so much. Um, I'm going to just put a few things in here and just show you what we have left. Then I'm going to cut the camera and um, get, you know, get all the inventory management taken care of. Then I'll, then I'll bring you back for the rest of it. Okay, we want that stuff. That we're not going to take. It's not even worth it. Ooh, look at that. How, are we hungry? Yeah, we're hungry. We can eat that. Beautiful. That'll give us some uh, health, too. Bandage is always good. Um, all right. Not bad, not bad. Okay, is that everything? Oh, we didn't do the fat loots. Yeah, okay, those we're going to scrap for parts. Take the rest of those. Okay, yeah, so let me get my inventory management done, and then I will... I'll bring you guys back and we'll just run through it again quickly as a clear. Where's my motorcycle? It's over here. And then do the loot at the end. All right, guys. Uh, we got our inventory management done. We're still pretty full here. And the bike is completely full too. So I think what I might do... Boy, that, uh, that reset this place all the way out to here, didn't it? Well, you know what? If we have to come back out... I put a, sh a chest down. We can do that. Um, and besides, I'm not going to loot for this last part anyway, so I can take care of that off camera uh, when we're done. So let's make sure we're all loaded here. This time we're essentially going to carefully speed run this. Um, wait, what? Oh, we got to turn it in first. Oh, shit. Is it, Wait, is that... Hold on, hold on. Is it because this one's not active? Nope. We do have to turn it in. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay. Well, um, which trainer is this? Oh, yeah, this is the one that's nearby. Okay. Well, let's go do that really quick, then. He's close enough. We have time. Howdy. You've made my day. And here is your... All right. Hand. Military gloves for 378. Shotgun for 378. Uh, or a schematic. Let's just take the shotgun. We can use it for the parts if we decide not to sell it. All right. Let's take another job from you. Uh, let's do this tier three fetch and clear. Would you kindly help me? That's the same damn down. house again. <laughs> okay, hold on. No need to hold apologize. on, hold on. Then. I'll check my other sources. We got to do something different than that one. Um, if we go to the north, to the north, clear zombies. Those are all clears. Uh, northeast is gonna take us more over towards the desert, I think. Well, maybe not. Maybe not. Let, let's go ahead and kindly take this one here. Little Great. I look forward. So the name of the game is Speed Run. Just get um, the place cleared. And then we'll um, worry about the loot at the end. Alright. Just leave some there. We're going to check this because I'm just not sure if it'll stick around. Um, craft steel spears. Okay, yeah, we'll take it. We'll take it. We'll bounce over this way. No zombies in here. Gonna be a couple in here. Let's get their heads lined up. You're not dead yet? Okay, we need to also activate or make this the active quest. That is the one we're working on, right? No, it's this one. Okay. Yeah, the fetch quest. Let's head on upstairs. Like I said, we'll loot later. Just clearing right now. Okay. Take care of them. Torso. Well, actually, with more legs. Okay, 
Can I in there? Okay. Okay. Why is there a yellow bag there? Did I not loot that the last time? I must not have. Edgar? I need to die. Did I completely forget the loot? Oh no, that's right, I left the, the wrench in there because we didn't really need it. Why am I looting? I'm not supposed to be looting right now. Can't help myself. Okay, how many dudes do we have? Can't tell. Three. Alright, they did. We got all the peeps upstairs. We can do our same plan as last time, right? Yeah, okay. Let's just get their attention. Is it just you? No, there's a couple of you. Okay, let's get reloaded here. Get them lined up. You get the shot in the nuts, man. Oh, that's gotta hurt. <laughs> that's gotta hurt. Something fierce, man. Something fierce. Okay, come on, zombos. Okay. We've got to take care of all the Zika Ruskies. Uh, we need to get our satchel, which is... Behind here. Okay, let's run back down to the bike really quick and take that, um... I grab that eye candy. Ah, uh, you know, screw it. <laughs> Wasting time. Wasting time. That's a streamer. I mean, a... Uh, yeah, a streamer. What the hell is she doing over there? <laughs> we must have really heated the place up, huh? Okay, so let's grab this. And uh, I'm going to put a chest down, because there is no way on God's green earth that we're going to be able to get everything that's in there. And then I'll just have to worry about sorting out later. Uh, but I, I want to show you guys the fat loots, and then we'll have to wrap up this episode, and then I'll just get the rest of it later. <laughs> I guess it doesn't matter if we put it far away or not. Because we just have to remember not to start a new quest until we get everything out of here. Of course, we'll lose it. Okay. <clears throat> She's not in the house, is she? Come on, get off her. Okay. Ah, let's see what we got. Come on, get some stamina back, dude. Here we go. Paper. Ooh, compound bow. It's a shitty one, but it's a compound bow. Um, that, we're going to scrap. In fact, we're going to scrap both of them because it's just not worth anything. Got a green wrench. Nice. Oh, shit. You know what? I need to be putting these on, too. Glad I thought of it before we checked the fat loots. Should have done that for the first two times, but... We didn't. Damn it, Jim. Okay, fat loots. All right. We'll take that. We'll scrap those. We're gonna, well, we might keep that and sell it. Military helmets are nice, but not ones like that. That sucks, and this sucks too, so we'll scrap those. All right, guys. Well, um, I think I'm going to leave you here. So we do have some bookshelves. To do, well, maybe I should do the bookshelves on camera real quick. Okay, so we got, um, craft special ammunition used to breach secure locks like doors, safes, and vaults. Oh, nice, okay. Breaching ammo. We'll take this, um, and just read it. We'll, we'll have a yellow quest day once I get enough of these, kill some rabbits with shotgun. Uh, once I get enough of those, you know, built up. All very nice. SMG auto and iron armor schematic. Okay. Not bad, not bad. This is bows to grade 20% slower. That'll come in handy when we do our stealth build. Here, let's eat this too. Just to free up the spot. Okay. Electric timer relay. When in combat, health recovers one hit point with every punch. Oh, yeah, look at that. <laughs> nice tactical assault rifle schematic, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful. We're definitely going to have to put some points in Machine Gunner now. I was planning on doing that anyway, but now we have even more reason to do so. Uh, Craft Hollow Point 44. Okay. And I think that's it for the bookshelves. I think that's it. Okay. All right, guys, that's it for this episode. Um, I might go through and... And, you know, loot some of the more basic stuff. 
Um, yeah, like that off camera. But um, that is it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share the video. And uh, we will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.